Gennadia. Three-year-old Kaysen is not just shouting gibberish, he's reiterating the Spanish words he is learning in pre-K in the Bright Minds Academy Preschool and Spanish Learning Center. The director of the school, Joanna Ham, is a former AISD bilingual teacher. Ham believes that by teaching children a second language at an early age, there is a greater chance of retention as well as fluency. If you start early on, once they're growing and if they continue the Spanish language, they should be able to sound like they've been speaking Spanish all their life. And basically, if they start from three to five, they have been speaking it. Kaysen's parents agreed that by enrolling Kaysen in the program, they were giving him a jump start on his education, especially since many schools now require Spanish as an elective. It's going to be very beneficial for him in his future with um, growing up as a teen, even maybe later on in his life um, trying to get a job. Spanish will be introduced to the children through story time, mathematics, and basic instructions throughout the day. He's responded really well with it. He, um, he has his moments where he forgets or he doesn't know maybe what I'm asking, but Joanna does really good with uh, Kaysen and all the other children reinforcing it daily and, and I think that's going to be the key. Studies show that this early learning of Spanish can lead to an understanding of other Latin-based languages, give children an academic advantage, and create an awareness of outside cultures. So I want to introduce them to all the wonderful things that they can see in different countries, not just in Mexico, but it'll, it'll open their minds to other languages, other cultures. Along with the preschool daily curriculum, the school offers extended care and Spanish lessons for school-age students. Gracias. Chelsea Goss, Pro News 7.